Tango 21 calling Mr. Chippy. Tango 21, if you'd like to set off now, I'm on the customer's Harrier CBHQ base station. Roger that, I'm going across the road to level crossing. Roger, got you going across the level crossing. Right, passing the Greyleys turn. Roger, got you at the Greyleys turn. You'll realise we're doing this test the opposite way to most of them. He started off six miles away and he's coming back towards me. That's because he's done a, uh, shall we say, more important test first. This is a customer's repair. I think we've covered the Harrier CBHQ before. Roger got you at the Kelby turn. Level crossing. Roger on that, got you loud and clear going over Wheelsford level crossing. Tango 21 from Mr Chippy, just going around Scratchy Corner on Wheelsford. Wow, that's excellent, S9. Uh, it's nice to have a meter that you can read as well. Now we can do a little bit scratchy but loud and clear. Okay, that's plus 10, so that's really good. Of course, having a forward facing speaker helps. Now going through Ancaster Crossroads. Roger, got your Ancaster Crossroads. So it's a mile away at that point. Roger, got you at Ancaster Service Station. And that concludes the test, thank you. Okay, well, it does what you say on the tin, doesn't it, that? 38 years old, works brilliantly. Every button has its own function. No hidden menus. I'm not being a fuddy-duddy, but it works. I was listening to some radio amateurs today. Um, I've forgotten what band we were on. And he said he'd bought something new, and he's disappointed it doesn't work better than what he's replacing it with. People must think that if they buy a new piece of radio equipment, or a new piece of hi-fi equipment, it's going to work better than the previous one. No, it'll just have more functions. It won't work better. And that's something to bear in mind. I had a, when I was at Nottingham Radio, the boss had a 1937 um, amplifier in his hi-fi equipment. And you wouldn't get better by having a new one, it just happened to be 1937. Right, so we'll, we're going to do something interesting now. We're going to, the next bit will be listening to this, to our base station. Now, our base station is a Harrier CBHQ, isn't it? So, are we going to have some kind of anomaly when I talk on a Harrier CBHQ to another CBHQ? Whoa, not done that before. Tango 21 testing the customer's Harrier CBHQ into our Harrier CBHQ. Testing one two three four five five four three two one. Thank you for watching.